When generating 2D drawings or views in particular here, in this case, you may end up with parts inside of your drawing that you don't necessarily want to see. Did you know that you could go into the drawings and just erase them? One example here, you can see I've used Project Explorer with a model view. While selecting the elements, you also have the option to say select objects that you want to show up in your camera. And by selecting very specifically, you'll get only the elements you selected. But the method I'm going to show here today is simply from the drawing itself. If I show the camera detail here, you'll see I can come into here and no, it's not up to date. Let me just refresh that. I have in here now the exact same elements that I have in my model. So you can see the beam going across the top and the elements connected. You'll notice that those beams going across here, where the other beam covers it, it's a dotted line. So if I wanted to remove this beam from my drawing, I can simply select that beam and hit delete. You'll get a gray box in here and the dotted lines still remain, but we're not quite finished yet. I'll also remove one of the connections just so you can see how versatile this is. And I'll select those connections and hit delete. Once you've finished removing the parts that you don't want to see, just go to your labels and dimensions tab, Use the Update Detail button and select that drawing. This will update your details. You'll notice that the hidden lines have disappeared, that beam has disappeared, the gray boxes have disappeared, and we get just that part going across. Where the connection is, also, this has been updated and the gray boxes are gone. And it's that simple. If you need to bring parts back, you can go to that green border on the inside that goes directly around this detail, double click on it, and you'll see in here, Restore User Erase Parts. This is not selective. It'll bring everything back, but you can check that box and say OK. And all of your parts will come back into your drawing. And then you can go back and get rid of just the ones that you don't want.